Hey guys, I'm Ethan from Ichiban Engineering and ISM here. Today we're going to talk about our pistons and rods that we currently make. As you can see, in every package that we sell, that you get home, you're going to get the design certified, signed by us, along with a spreadsheet showing the weight of each rod, the big end and the small end of the rod, so you can balance your and blueprint your engine. Uh, the way we do it, I'm going to demonstrate it a bit. This is a K24 rod. Uh, there's a special instrument and a scale, not your uh, normal kitchen scale. It's a bit more accurate. It have to be straight. Then we got to get the weight of the small end. And this table is not the best, but obviously then we're going to basically flip it out. We will need to adjust this thing. And the way to do it is like this. And then we can measure the big end of the rod, which is 419 grams. We can also check the total weight and see if our measurements was correct. And that's a good uh, way to check this. I'm going to put it on the scale again, calibrate the scale. We can measure it like this by putting the rod like this, 630, about right. Or we can put it like this. This is uh, our I-beam design. We got here two pockets extra. It's a bare, it gives bare rigidity to the beam. Uh, we also added uh, two oil holes instead of just one for better oiling for the rest pane of the piston. I'm gonna show it to you. I'm gonna give you better oiling than the normal rods. Um, we use ARP 625 on a specific uh, rod. You can get ARP 2000 as well. And some companies sell fake ARPs, unfortunately. We use only original ARP fasteners that we get from ARP, that's an important thing I wanted to clarify. About our pistons, these are aluminum, aluminum pistons, like in most engines, these are forged 2618 aluminum. As you can see here, these are 2JZ pistons, 86.5. Other than the normal things that you get, uh, when you're ordering a piston, they normally tell you it's an 86.5 bore, but it's actually not. You have to measure it yourself, send it to the machine shop most of the time. We also include a spreadsheet just like this one, uh, we check the pistons for you ahead of time. There is a special point on the piston that you need to measure it. If you measure it in the wrong location, it will be different because the shape of the piston is not a complete circle. And that is because when the piston is heating up, it's gonna expand unevenly. And in order to get it to be in a perfect shape when it expands through the cylinder wall, uh, the machining process uh, make it a bit oval. So there is a specific point where you should really measure a piston and it's right around here. Uh, obviously we do it in better conditions, but just for demonstrations, this piston is an 86.468. So we'll do it to all pistons that comes in a set so you can also use that information. You can also double check before sending to the machine shop. Um, yeah, that's about our pistons. You get them with the wrist pins, obviously. These are billet steel wrist pins. Uh, we can, for more uh, heavy duty applications, they'll be a bit thicker. It depends on your application as well. The car behind me is a four wheel drive EK Civic. It's a K24 swapped engine it's using our i900XR turbo. It's basically a 6466 dual dual bearing unit. Also, uh, you can see the our header, our uh, turbo manifold that we make here at ISM, uh, running our injectors. This is our, uh, we made like a nice uh, hood exit for that turbo as well. This engine uses our pistons and rods, making 755 wheel horsepower. It ran 10.2 second quarter mile just a few days ago at Honda Day. We test our products prior to selling it. Um, this is another engine we built with the same rods as the K24 rods. Uh, this engine specifically gonna make a bit over a thousand horsepower in a different car. It's also a Civic EK uh, 96 to 99 models. And yeah, that's it for today. You can check our products today on insanemotorsports.com. If you want to reach us for any custom request, something that we don't make currently, we can make custom roads for you and custom pistons. Uh, sometimes we'll, we'll require some minimum order, but we can do it. You can message us today on Facebook, Instagram. Thank you.